Hey guys, welcome to uh, this part of the video. Um, what I'm gonna do is create a galaxy. I'm using um, different spray paints. I've got them back here in the background. And then what I did is create one of these um, templates. Um, it's hard stock and then I put tape over it uh, to make it a little bit, you know, workable. So the first step is to add it down. And then what I'm gonna do is, the first step is just to add a quick circle on here so we can kind of get an idea of where it's, you know the middle part's gonna go so we'll get that done um, and then the next step is to take some of the black and just kind of spray paint that so that part's gonna be this part all right once it's all done so We'll just go real quick, do that. All right, maybe do a little bit of the edges because that's gonna be black. So we'll just take care of that now. All right, so we'll do that. We'll let that dry. And then we'll start adding the uh, um, the galaxy and the, the different col colors of purple. Uh, we're gonna add some blues, some uh, greens. I'll probably throw a little bit of this one. It's kind of like a more like a neon color. So it'll make it really um, stand out. So let that dry. All right, so now um, it's pretty dry. So what I'll do is um, add the template back on, kind of, uh, you know, set it to uh, a spot where I feel comfortable and kind of symmetrical. And then um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add this right here. It is a little heavy, but um, you know, we'll do it pretty quick so it doesn't damage the, uh, the canvas. So now we just use some, uh, some greens and kind of just start spraying around it. Um, the purple doesn't have to be perfect. Um, go back around with some blues. And down here, add a little bit of the, maybe the neon green if I can get it open. All right, so let's see what we got here. Some green again. Some of it's gonna be gone anyways because uh, you know once we lay the template back down, um, you know it'll be gone. All right, so just keep playing around, kind of spray it in an angle too. All right, uh, maybe use a little bit of green again, right, and then. Go back to some green. And then go back with the purple. Make sure you get around in there just to make sure, just so we can get that circle. And then go back with some of the green. And I don't know if you can see some of the splatter. That's fine because we're going to add. Um, some of the uh, the white um, sparkle sprinkles, um, you know, to create the stars. So, boom, you got that. So now we'll just let that dry, and then we'll add the template again, and then we'll create the uh, outer part. All right, so now that it's dry, um, I'm gonna place the template back up, and um, kind of gauge it, does that have to be exactly precise but you want it to be pretty close obviously and then we'll just take the black paint spray paint and just kind of go over the edges Mm 
go. All right, so that should be pretty good. Get these out of the way now. Get that part out. Get this one out. And then, there you go. So now you got the shape of it. Um, next thing is we're gonna let it dry and then we're gonna add some stars. Okay, so the next step now is take some white um, acrylic paint and one of these gadgets um, to help with the splatter. Um, you can get these online at any craft stores. Uh, this particular one I believe I got at Jerry's Artorama, um, but I'm sure you can find them in other places, maybe even Amazon too. So um, anyway, so let's start. And basically what it is, you dip it and then just stand over it and kind of just go like this and spread it around. Um, you'll get tiny little white spots which is perfect um, and then you can go back with a with a brush or something like that and add bigger ones but just even with some of the the technique like that it'll make uh, even bigger ones too so you just gotta just move around um, dip it again Didn't get enough and then go back go closer to get those really fine ones and then you can go back out some more and then get some of the bigger ones like I said some of them you can go and just stand over it I've done it in an angle before and they just kind of go this way more oval um, so anyways just keep playing around maybe I'll go one more higher All right, so basically this is what it looks like up close. See, so you see all kinds of little stars. And even those purple ones, that's fine because what I'm going to do, I'm going to go back with a tiny brush and add different color ones. And then I'll go make a little comment to meteors as well. Uh, for the purpose of the vi this video, is just to kind of show you how to create a galaxy and then using a template or anything that you have and then uh, it looks pretty cool once and it's pretty easy too so um let it dry and then I'll go back and add stars in different colors and uh, and comets and things like that all right so now we can add um, more um, spots to it so we can use like uh, oranges um, some purples some greens and just add uh, more to those you know to the stars um, anyway so just doesn't take too many only just a couple of spots All right, so while the brush is somewhat wet, just um, dip it slightly. And this brush is kind of, just kind of, and then just take, just kind of streak it. little bit out of it you can always go back again all right and maybe do the other side right here So just wipe your brush and then
just go back and add a little bit more to it. It's a little bit harder because the cam is so far down because I'm trying to get the whole thing on the camera. You can make it bigger. Same thing with this one, just kind of make the comet somewhat bigger. All right, what I'll do is um, I'll clean it up some and then uh, it's pretty much complete. All right, so um, it's pretty much it right here. Um, basically, you know, it's pretty simple. I mean, it does take some practice, um, especially because you're going to be critical uh, of your work. All artists are. Um, you know, and I made some mistakes, but that, it's it's fine. You know, for what for what it is, we know what it is, and um, you know, it's it's not that hard. Um, basically, you have to invest obviously in the canvas, um, some spray paints. Um, you know, make sure you get some blacks, um, some purples, some greens, blues, um, and if you have some acrylic paints for like the yellows, add it. You know, some more like purple and an aqua greenish color and uh and making the template that's the other thing um but the results are pretty cool you know i mean like i said it can be better or you know it's a lot of trial and error so um you know the key is just having fun and uh and practicing and uh you know don't don't forget to uh paint the sides and um you know that's it for this one so i hope you enjoyed it i hope you got some great tips out of it practice at home um and you know let me know what you think uh let me know how it goes and um you know please support like my page follow and uh i'll have some other videos um posted um shortly thanks guys god bless